A new elementary school in Buckeye named after the late Arizona Senator John McCain is dedicated today. It's so quite the story. Yeah, it's a special school with it a special is. name uh, after a man who had a huge impact on our state. Good morning, Des. Hey, Des. Good morning. Good morning. Such a special school. Uh, John McCain, the late senator, means so much to the state of Arizona. Uh, so they are just so excited to open this elementary school in honor of him. And take a look at where we're standing here. This is um, called the Oculus of the school. It's absolutely beautiful. And uh, we're going to talk about the design features and how this was built. We have Dr. Wilson. She is the superintendent of Buckeye Schools here. So, Dr. Wilson, tell us about uh, John S. McCain Elementary here. Well, good morning. It's a pleasure to be here. Uh, we are just so excited and thrilled to open our new John S. McCain Elementary School. The school itself was um, inspired and uh, by the, the late senator. It's a CSTEM slash humanities focused school and um, we're just honored to be here with you today. And we also have Barry Chase with the Chase Building Team. Come on, step in here, Barry. Uh, you guys started groundbreaking in November of 2020. Tell us how quickly you got this building up and what is so special about what we're seeing here in this area. Well, overall construction took about nine months. Uh, took a heroic team effort from all parties, owner, architect, and ourselves. So we couldn't be more proud of it. This design that you're looking at right now, this is the sky bridge. So from the exterior, it actually looks like the uh, landing of an aircraft carrier. So it's really, really cool how they brought a thoughtful design in place. These walls that you see, let the natural light pour in. Um, and then the timeline on the wall to the uh, right over there is designed with all the key uh, milestones of uh, John McCain's military career and his service career as a senator. So just really, really special design elements throughout this project. We also did uh, tilt up concrete on the exterior walls, which is very unique in school construction. So that was a really cool component of this too. Okay, and let's walk you guys. Let's go through the doors here and check out uh, some of the learning areas where the students are going to be. Um, tell us where we're entering now. We're entering the um, upper grades, which is our, uh, the building itself is a ki uh, kindergarten through eighth grade, and upstairs is where our sixth grade through eighth grade wing is. And inside the classrooms, you're going to notice all of the classrooms are glass partitioned, uh, walls that are expandable and contractible. Um, the school itself is a C-STEM humanities focused, and so a computer science immersion is really a language in itself, where we're asking students to um, learn how to code. Uh, they'll build robots, but um, in Initially, the, the program itself also makes um, sure that students are learning of the Arizona standards. We're, we're teaching them to, you know, evident, uh, reading, writing, mathematics. Uh, we also offer PE, um, uh, music, art. So we have the, the fundamental core programs of what you would expect in all classes in Arizona. So everything traditional with that CSTEM added and kind of at the forefront, obviously, as it's so important as we head into the future to learn all of that uh, and talk about what's so unique in the classrooms with the tables and the chairs and even the teacher's desk. So one of the things that we wanted to make sure we um, highlighted inside the classrooms was the ability for um, students to be able to um, expand and contract their thinking and we feel like furniture is really important uh, for them to do that. So the late senator in his um, collaborative efforts in his ability to be flexible and work across the aisle those kinds of things that were uh, good for the senator. We wanted kids to be able to do that inside our classroom. That's amazing. And Barry, have you ever built a school like this? I mean, we're seeing gl side and glass doors in this open concept. No, it's very, very progressive and it's really cool. So these doors all retract. So you actually have learning in the classroom or as they refer to it as a learning studio, but the actual learning can continue in the hallway. So it's very interactive. These walls can retract fully. The classroom can overflow. There's design and education elements here, like with this marker board wall. Mm -hmm. The kids can actually have breakout sessions. It's really, really, really an amazing uh, design. You see acoustic bas baffles up in the ceiling, and that helps to keep uh, control of the sound, so it's never too loud. Mm -hmm. um, and the kids, it's amazing. They, they're not distracted at all. It's okay. really wonderful. So great. And enrollment is still open. You still have some space for students. We have to wrap it up, but real quickly, just tell us where you're located so parents know. We are located in Buckeye, Arizona. It's about 20 miles outside of um, Phoenix, and we're right off of Lower Buckeye Road and uh, Miller. Okay, perfect. There you have it, guys. The school is so amazing. So many different unique features.